Hey everyone, welcome back. I want to take a moment to thank you all for your support in reaching 3,000 subscribers. It truly means a lot. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create shape animations using a light motion. So, stick around till the end to learn all the tips and tricks. Let's get started. Open the Alight Motion app. Select a polygon shape and set its duration to 4 seconds on the timeline. Select the layer and tap on border and shadow. Apply a stroke and remove the fill color of the shape. To add a bookmark, simply tap on the time and the bookmark will be added. Create three bookmarks. The first at one second, the second at two seconds, and the third at three seconds, like this. Tap on the layer, go to Move and Transform, and select Rotation. Add a keyframe at one second, then add another keyframe at two seconds, and rotate it to negative 180 degrees. Add a third keyframe at three seconds, and rotate it to negative 270 degrees. Adjust the graph the same way I'm doing it. Now, at two seconds, add a rectangle shape. Apply a stroke, remove the fill color. And trim it to last for four seconds on the timeline. Parent the rectangle shape to the polygon shape. Hit that subscribe button for more awesome content like this, guys. Adjust the shape size. Select the polygon shape and trim it at the two second mark on the timeline. Add a null layer and cut it to four seconds on the timeline. Parent the polygon layer to the null layer. Select the rectangle layer, go to Move and Transform, then Rotation, and add a keyframe. At the end, add another keyframe and set it to 359 degrees. Adjust the graph the same way I'm doing it. Select the polygon layer, add a keyframe at the beginning and rotate it to negative 90 degrees. Adjust the graph the same way I'm doing it. Select the null layer, go to move and transform, then zoom in, zoom out, and add three keyframes at the bookmarked points. For the middle keyframe, zoom out as per your preference And adjust the graph the same way I'm doing. Don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials and tips. At the end of the layer, add one keyframe and zoom out. 
Do it the same way you did for the middle keyframe. And adjust the graph the same way I'm doing. At the beginning of the same layer, add a keyframe and zoom out, just like you did for the middle and end keyframes. And adjust the graph the same way I'm doing. Now it should look smooth. Select all layers and group them. Then select the group layer and tap on Edit Group. In the top right corner, tap on the settings icon and set the retiming option to loop. Go back and set the group layer to 5 seconds. Add a rectangle shape and fill the composition area with it. For the background, use the color I've chosen. Change the color of the group layer to match your background. Go to Effects, search for Tiles, apply that effect, and then crop it. Now duplicate the group layer, move it like I did and change the color. Now just export it 